It's my house, come on, turn it up. What's going on guys? It's your boy 99X and Kids here today. Bring you a little gameplay slash commentary here. And yeah, so this is For Honor. It's a brand new Ubisoft game. I played the closed beta last weekend. This video was meant to be up on Sunday, but I had a lot of issues. It was supposed to be part of the double upload weekend for me last weekend, but I guess I'm pushing it to this weekend since it would be, won't be fair and stuff. And yeah, so my apologies on that. Uh, pretty much, it's my fault. I had issues with my computer or time to record also, so I didn't have a lot of time. So first things first is I want to really talk about this game. It's actually pretty fun, I'm not going to lie. It's so f I have fun playing with this. Uh, as you can see, I'm playing as a samurai, I think. Yeah, samurai. Uh, the assassin one, which is the hardest one apparently, but to me I don't seem it's that hard. I, it'll be like seeing like what I do in this game. It's pretty fun. And I also want to tell you that today is also the open beta. I'm probably going to upload this today, which is Friday, February 3rd. So, yeah, so pretty much this is going to be uploaded today. Hopefully around the afternoon. And yeah, so check it out. Check out the, ve the beta. I don't know where it's gonna be. Most likely for me on PS4 or PlayStation will be on the PlayStation Store. Uh, PC probably Steam or Ubisoft website and Xbox their their store and stuff. So that's pretty much where you can find the open beta. I think I don't know the start time. So. Uh, so yeah, let's talk about the gameplay mechanics of this game. Uh, the gameplay mechanics makes it fun, I think. It's like, there is some type of issues I had like with it, but not really. Uh, like for controller settings, I wish it could be like, you can reconfig like buttons and stuff. Because on the beta, it was only on like my right hand side, like most of the attack buttons and the important button and then you also have to do like the one side you're moving but in my fair opinion I think I like have it it's it's 50 50 for me but uh hmm, what else do I want to talk about uh the game modes so this game mode is domination 4v4 first one to get to 1000 points and then eliminate the other team wins that's the basic of this game so yeah and that's pretty much it there's also a tv2 uh and a 1v1 i haven't tried those out yet but i'll try it in the weekend or this weekend so there might be also some live streams i might be doing about this game hopefully but that's what i'm gonna do uh, so most likely I want to try the, like, the 2v2s and the 1v1s, see if I, I, I'm skilled enough to, to be on my own. Uh, I'm also going to try some other characters. Uh, so, And if you are not good in the game, you can also practice against AI. And also if you want to like have a group, you and your group of friends, or you and randoms can play, do like player versus AI, which is alright. I don't know the AI difficulty in this game, so so I really don't know. Uh, the health in this game is actually pretty good. I don't find I get killed like too instantly. The pen, uh, and then there's also upgrades and stuff. But as you can see in this clip right now, you see how I'm regaining health. You need to be in like a uh, your point to regain health or health. Sorry about for my bad grammar. <laughs> But yeah, so pretty much that's it. If you want to get health, and then there, I do like a little bit of. I just try to figure out what stuff in this game. Pretty fun. Uh, in this game, one thing about the ladders: if you press R1 on the PS4 controller, 
it will you can punch people off the ladder so and then if you're going down the ladder you can hold circle to slide down and it also pushes people off the ladder so that's like one thing I didn't show in this game because I didn't learn it right away I, I did a little bit more experimenting after this video or this game so yeah and player your upgrades also come at the end of the game too like you can salvage or you can use them and you can also buy packs of upgrades which give you a higher tier uh, one thing I'm really bad about the assassin classes in this game is that they have really low health and if you take a heavy attack from one of the stronger guys it will knock down your health pretty low so my recommendation if you're gonna be playing an assassin is just to be preying on your kills probably support your teammates stay in the health points or in the cap points so that it's not affecting you and stuff like that but uh, I think that's the best I can tell you for how to play there's also like the the medium character which is like the first ones I think and then there's like the heavy heavy health heavy hit like light hitter characters but they're slow to move so those are like the second tier of class so in this game in the beta right now this was the closed beta we only had options to three game modes and nine characters in the next in the open beta starting today until Monday I think or Sunday ish uh, the things will be in the beta will be five game modes and or no four game modes and nine characters same thing so but in the whole game you get like five game modes I think that's what they said uh, as I read I was reading some articles and stuff but one of the game modes is called elimination it's I think you get the point it's if you die you won't be able to respawn kinda like a search and destroy in COD and other and some similar type of like that but yeah so pretty much that's what elimination is and it's 4v4 also so if you want to play more like 4v4s I'd recommend elimination or domination if you and your friend want to play 2v2s brawl will be the best spot to go and then if you think you're a g god at this game maybe you could go into the duels 1v1 it, it'll be it could be fun so pretty much that's this game uh, I would recommend it to people honestly it's a pretty good game almost kinda Similar to Calvary, that game on PC, like with, the, with that too, I think it's very close to it. I think it's gonna be a great game. But let me down, let me know in the comments below if you guys think this game will be good, and also comment down if you're gonna be playing the open beta this weekend. So yeah, hopefully you like my little review of this game. Uh, Star wise, I would probably give it maybe. For the alpha close beta, three and a half out of five, because there were some issues I had a little before I had, but I think they fixed it over time. So we'll see at the end of the open beta if my ratings will change. But hopefully you guys will enjoy it. Don't forget to leave a like. Hope you enjoyed this video, and yeah. So don't forget to leave a like. Check out the links below, and make sure you subscribe and hit that bell button. So see you guys next time in the next one. Peace, guys.